so the Irish Extreme here. I'm taking a break from my workout this afternoon because I got a very important thing to do this afternoon. And that important thing is I got to go to the t-shirt shop and request all the printing for my t-shirts and uh, also got this. It's my pro wrestling gear that I also need to get print on to uh, update, to uh, customize my gear. Make it custom to the Irish Extreme. And in the bag there, I got, they're all green. It's all green for the Irish Extreme. It's all green for the Irish Extreme in there. But it's a uh, biker trunks, knee pad covers, and the kick pad covers because the Irish Extreme uses kick pads, not the standard wrestling boots. And uh, kind of goes with being extreme. And uh, so, in between my workout, I already did the body workout. In between that and going to do the cardio, I'm stopping at the t shirt print shop dropping off my wrestling gear to get custom made and I'm um, gonna order the t-shirts to get made that way I got t-shirts to sell to all my fans because who doesn't like buying t-shirts at a wrestling show especially to support the hometown boy and uh, so it's all coming along it's all building to for everybody to go to the extreme and it's all building my brand, building it up there. Everybody's going to be a fan of the Irish Extreme, I have a feeling. And the shirts are going to be a hit. My gear is going to be a hit. So keep watching. The Irish Extreme is coming up. About to go to the print shop to get everything made. Even have it drawn up. So keep watching. So, a little bit of bad news, a t-shirt shop, because of the material of the pro wrestling gear, won't be able to print on it, so I got to go try another t-shirt shop that does straight to fabric stuff, see if I can get my pro wrestling gear custom there. Keep you guys updated with the, uh, with everything that goes on. Ho hopefully this next store is reasonably priced and does it well. So I'm leaving the screen printing shop, dropped off my wrestling gear, the knee pad covers, kick pad covers, and uh, biker trunks at the screen print shop. And they actually do the non-cracking, uh, straight to the clothing print so that they'd be able to do it unlike the place doing the t-shirt where they do the inks that will crack that's why they want to do the gear so the last place I went to will actually work and the Irish Extreme will have his gear all set for the show looking so fly so just uh, stick stay back with uh, the Irish Extreme and keep watching and uh, gears getting made for the show gonna look fly gonna have shirts to sell and uh, look good for the fans so right now I'm going for my second part of my workout the cardio portion I lift weights at home I like home better than a gym because I don't have all these meatheads everywhere that like to take up machines and really piss off the Irish Extreme. They don't want to see the Irish Extreme pissed off. Uh, Tri-States Wrestling got a new senior official, senior referee, because Nathaniel Maverick, he... Uh, took a payout in one of the matches and so 
They want someone that they could trust a lot more than Nathaniel Maverick. Luckily, Nathaniel Man Maverick could still be an active wrestler. But he's suspended indefinitely from refn duties, which is good because when the Irish Extreme wins, gets his hand raised on the debut in his hometown of Los Animas, do not want any excuses of a biased ref. It'll all be the Irish Extreme. And so I'm continuing my workout to making sure that I could give the match to win. To give the fans a good show. Get that match of a night. And uh, so there, there, there's been that issue. Don't want the ref clouding the judgment of, oh, it was unfair. It was unfair. Oh. Yeah, so. Whatever. I'm just going to do me. Make sure the fans enjoy everything. And so I got the t-shirts being made. So I got the t-shirts being made. And I got my gear that's being customized at a cheap price. $12.95 plus tax to customize my biker trucks, knee pad covers, and kick pad covers. It's a good price. And uh, so in about two weeks, I'll have my t-shirts and I'll have my customized gear ready for the show in June. And ready for more fans to become Irish Extreme fans. I already have some. I know I'm going to get more because I'm going to put on a hell of a show. There's a reason why I got top rope tatted on my arm. So, now's the cardio portion of my workout. And I'll hit you guys up later. So, right now I'm going to La Junta. Going to the print shop. Uh, they need a little advice on my wrestling gear. We got the designs all worked out. It's a little different from the designs of what's going to be on the t-shirt but it's as close as we could get searching online but I still need to stop by there and check out what she needs information on and uh, because this person customizing my gear it's the first time she's worked on pro wrestling gear so it's a first for her Really, it's the first for the Irish Extreme to get customized gear because, like I said, I've been in the business for a while, but it's stepping up my brand and it's giving the fans more of my brand. And uh, so she just needs information on where to place it on the gear and really the placement of the gear. And she said it'll be ready by Monday getting a good deal on prices for it so I'm really happy and the t-shirts will be done by May 10th definitely enough time for the show in June so I'm definitely ecstatic about it definitely happy about how it's going getting everything customized and uh, tomorrow Tomorrow is Santa Fe Trail Day. It's a town holiday in Los Animas. And that's where Tri-States Wrestling is having all a majority of the shows. Is in my hometown of Los Animas. And uh, talk to Joel Chapman, one of the owners of Tri-States Championship Wrestling. And uh, it's a little short notice to do it this year for, well, for tomorrow for Santa Fe Trail Day. But, uh, it's definitely, uh, got something planned for next year for San Fe Trail Day. And it's definitely going to be something that's going to be an annual thing for San Fe Trail Day. So, uh, there's that. So, my gear's getting customized. Just got to stop by there and give her the information that she needs. And, uh... 
the Los Animas celebration tomorrow. That comes once a year, and next year it's going to be bigger thanks to Tri-State's Championship Wrestling. It'll be bigger.